Hello friends, uh, in this video I am going to discuss about uh, thermal, chemical, mechanical and thermodynamic equilibrium and pure substance. The system is said to be in a state of thermodynamic equilibrium when no change in any microscopic property is registered when the system is isolated from its surroundings. A system is in thermodynamic equilibrium when it satisfies the following three equilibrium conditions which are mechanical equilibrium, chemical equilibrium and thermal equilibrium. The absence of unbalanced force either within the system or between the system and surroundings then the system is in mechanical equilibrium. If there are any unbalanced force either between the system or both the system will undergo change of state until mechanical equilibrium is attained. When there is no chemical reaction or transfer of matter from one part of the system to another, such as diffusion or solution, the system is in chemical equilibrium. A system existing in mechanical and chemical equilibrium is separated from its surroundings by a diathermic wall and if there is no spontaneous change in any macroscopic property of the system, the system is said to exist in a state of thermal equilibrium. If it is not in thermal equilibrium, the system will undergo change of state until it reaches thermal equilibrium. If any one of these equilibriums are not satisfied, the system is not in thermodynamic equilibrium or it is in non-equilibrium state. If the non-equilibrium is due to uh, the presence of unbalanced force, the pressure is not uniform throughout the system and there will not be a single pressure uh, with reference to the system as a whole. If the non-equilibrium is due to the difference in temperature between the system and surroundings, uh, there will be difference in temperature between the system and surrounding and the temperature is not uniform and there is no single temperature with reference to the system as a whole. A substance which has homogeneous and invariable chemical composition throughout its mass that is called as pure substance. The relative proportions of the chemical elements constituting the substance are also constant. Some of the examples of pure substance are atmospheric air, steam water mixture, combustion products of fuel etc. The mixture of air and liquid air cannot be considered as pure substance as the relative proportions of nitrogen and oxygen are not same when they are in, uh, in liquid and uh, gaseous state when it is existing in equilibrium. 